guys, have you ever wondered which toilet paper dissolves the fastest? Let's find out today! It's time for a science experiment! So here's what you'll need for this science experiment. Different brands of toilet paper, a container for each brand that you want to use, of course you'll need a sheet for each one, and you're going to need some water. First you just want to pour some water into each Tupperware. Just an even amount into each one. Once you have your water ready, now just take all of your toilet paper and put it flat on top of the water. Then you want to put your lid on each one. And to simulate a flush of a toilet, all you do is shake each tub once. So our four brands that we're testing here is the Scott brand, White Cloud, the Good Earth, Up and Up, the Target brand, and Quilted Northern. Now that we've given each container its flush, we need to wait 24 hours for the dissolving action to take place, and we'll see which one is the most dissolved in 24 hours. While we're waiting, I'd be interested to know, what kind of toilet paper do you guys use? Let me know down in the comments below. Our toilet paper of choice is the Target brand, Up and Up. If y'all want to see pictures of me wiping my butt, wiping my butt, wiping my butt, make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Look at that, you can click on those. Go ahead, click them, it's fun. And if you're not subscribed, you should definitely subscribe so that you can see more of my ridiculous videos. All right, guys, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Make sure to thumb up this video. Wow, fit my butt, butt, butt. All right, guys, we are back 24 hours later, and let's take a look at what we have here. First, we have the Scott brand toilet paper. Then this is the White Cloud Good Earth. Here we have the Up and Up Target brand. And this is the Quiltered Northern. Oh, wow. Let me get y'all in a little closer. So the Scott tissue, you can see how it's breaking apart and the layers are kind of coming off there. The white cloud honestly doesn't look much different except that it's wet. The up and up, you can see definitely some tattering around the edges, but not like the Scott brand tissue was. So far the Scott one seems to be the best. And the Quilted Northern looks like it's the worst one. It doesn't have any kind of tears or anything. Now we're gonna pick them up and see if they tear. Quilted Northern, up and up. Ooh, that one tore because there's a little piece still down in there. See? The White Cloud Good Earth, nope, nothing tore there. And the Scott brand. Yeah, this one, God, I can't even pick up the whole thing without it tearing. Scott brand is definitely the winner as far as disintegration goes. Now let's do one more little test. And for this test, I want to put all the lids back on and we're going to shake them vigorously and see if they disintegrate anymore. And so that they get the same amount of shake, I'm going to shake them all at once. Ready? Alright, let's see what we have now. Here's our Quilted Northern. Nice and dissolved, but a little fibrous in there, you can still see it. The Up and Up, oh wow. That's just like kind of cloudy in there. That's impressive. White Cloud Good Earth. Uh, fibrous. Not as fibrous as the Quilted Northern though. It's a little less fibrous, so it's dissolved a little bit more. Uh, the, the water's not as cloudy too. I think that that's kind of interesting compared to the Up and Up. The Up and Up has a little bit more of a cloud to it. And the Scott brand. Oh wow. <laughs> I can't see anything in that. I mean, a little bit of fiber, but geez, that stuff disintegrated. Scott Brand is the winner. So if you guys want more science experiments from me, make sure to click that subscribe button. I definitely appreciate that. And also a thumbs up. Can you guys thumb up this video? I'd appreciate that too. Now let's take a picture for Instagram and see if you guys can guess which toilet paper is which one just from the picture. If you want to follow me on Instagram, I'll put that right down there. And there's also Twitter and Facebook, and you can click on those. You can click on them. They'll take you where you need to go, and you can follow me. That would be awesomely shiggity shank of you. Also, I want to give a shout out to Gone With The Winds. They're the people who did this experiment first, and they kind of gave me the idea to do this. They're also full-time RVers, so make sure to go and check out their channel. I'll link it up down below. Thank you guys for watching, and thanks for being shiggity shank. All right, guys, let's try it again. What's she saying? I can't move.
Funny rats.